you know, when I start, I've been practicing for 12 years. When I started practicing, I wasn't interested in, in kids' nutrition, but after having my own kids, it really sparked that interest. And picky eaters really intrigued me. Why do kids eat the way that they do? Why do they become picky? And I wanted to learn more about that. And there really wasn't uh, a lot out there. And then eating got so easy. I love food. I'm such a foodie. I will eat anything. Doesn't matter what part of the world I'm in, I will try it. And then I have a little girl who doesn't want to eat anything. And I could not comprehend why she wouldn't be interested in food. But the thing is, eating is the most difficult sensory task that children do. TH2 dominance is probably the more common one that I see in kids. This is allergy, too much histamine, chronic ear infections, eczema. Oh, you just gave me goosebumps, thank you. Because <laughs> you couldn't hear, she said this was fantastic. <laughs> you missed it. No, 